Let's go over how you can rotate an object around a specific point using Adobe Illustrator. So as you may already know, you can use the selection tool to rotate objects, but the object by default rotates around the center point of the object. If you want to rotate around a different point other than the center point, you'll have to use the rotate tool for that. So to access that, let's come over here to the menu and hold a click over the reflect tool, and we should get this little flyout menu right here with the rotate tool available. You can also access it by pressing the letter R on your keyboard. And when you select that tool, you should notice a tiny little crosshair in the center of your object. This crosshair represents the rotation point of the object. If you click and drag this crosshair elsewhere, you'll be able to rotate the object around that point, as you can see there. And if you hold shift while you're rotating, you can see it locks it onto 45 degree increments. Now, if you want to rotate your object based on a specific numerical value, you can do so by holding alt and then clicking and dragging the rotation point. If you're using Mac, it would be Option. And then you get this little menu that pops up here where you can input your rotation value. You could either type it in manually, or you can use this little handle right here to slide it around until you get the value you want. And once you're finished, you can click OK. So let's have a look at an example of when this sort of thing would be useful. I'm going to grab my selection tool, and I'm going to select this object right here, and I'm going to grab my rotation tool, and I'm going to take this crosshair or this rotation center and snap it to the center of this object down here. Now I have smart guides enabled in order to do this. If you want to make sure that you can snap your rotation center, just go to view and enable smart guides right there. And once you do that, you can click and drag to rotate the object. I'm going to hold shift to lock it onto 45 degree angles. And I'm also going to hold alt or option to make a duplicate copy. And once you do that, you can press control D or command D repeatedly and you get that effect right there. So that is how you can rotate around a specific point using Adobe Illustrator.